लिटिल रेड राइडिंग हुड लॉन्ग टाइम ए गो देयर लिप्ट अ लिटिल गर्ल नेम्ड लिटिल रेड राइडिंग हुड सी लिप्ट विथ हर मदर इन अ स्मल भिलेज नेयर अ डीप डार्क फरेस्ट वन डे हर मदर कल्ड हर ओवर ओ डार्लिंग यू नो योर ग्रैंड मदर इज इल उल यू ब्रिंग अ बास्केट फर योर ग्रैंड मदर I put some cookies, cakes and fresh herb into the basket that are good for her health, said her mother. Of course, mummy, I will do it, said little red riding hood. She was holding the baskets and started down her journey to her grandmother's house. Little red riding hood heard a sound coming from the bushes suddenly a big bad wolf appeared in front of her where are you going little girl what is your name asked the big bad wolf my name is little red riding hood i am going to my grandma's cottage at the end of the forest okay goodbye mr wolf I better go now said little red riding hood The big bad wolf was quite hungry and suddenly he got an idea that he would fast shallow grandma and then ate the little girl so quickly he rushed to the grandma's house The big bad wolf knocked on the door and said grandma It's me, Little Red Riding Hood. My dear, the door is already open," said Grandma. Then the big bad wolf entered the house. But seeing the big bad wolf, Grandma immediately ran and hid in a cupboard. Just then, he heard Little Red Riding Hood's voice, "Grandma." I am Little Red Riding Hood. Will I come in? Yes, my dear. Please come in," said the wolf, imitating Grandma's voice. Little Red Riding Hood came to the house. She saw that Grandma looked something different. Grandma, why are your eyes so big? asked Little Red Riding Hood. So that I can see you better. replied the wolf grandma why are your ears so big asked little red riding hood so that i can hear you better replied the wolf grandma why are your nose so big asked little red riding hood so that i can smell you better replied the wolf grandma why are your teeth so big asked the little red riding hood so that i can eat you better ha 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 replied the wolf and he returned to his real look then little red riding hood quickly ran and hid in the cupboard with her grandma the wolf roared loudly and started pulling the cupboard door help help cried little red riding hood Just then a hunter was passing through the cottage he heard the howl of the wolf <coughs> the hunter quickly walked up and charged the wolf with his gun boom in a moment the wolf broke through the roof of the cottage and flew into the sky and fell so far that he could never come back ah Then the hunter rescued little red riding hood and her grandma. Grandma welcomed the hunter with hot coffee and the big bad wolf never ever and ever came back there.